what do you do with the keto diet to get the fastest weight loss, right? Do you exercise? Do you take a fat burner like, you know, the old products like Hydroxycut or something like that? I'm assuming, you know, some people will drink a lot of lemon juice or uh, apple cider vinegar, ACV, uh, green beans. I've never heard that one before. Um, and then went on to say, whenever I follow the keto diet, I'm losing about two and a half kilograms per week, which I think is about a pound. That's it's a lot more than that. Oh, it is. Anyhow, just continue. Oh, yeah, I'm bad at the math. Um. So, how do you lose the most amount of weight on keto? How do you optimize keto for fat loss? So, number one, I'm going to say intermittent fast. I would say 16 to 18 hour intermittent fasts every day. Okay. Um, to extend your body's fat burning period. The amount of time your body has to go through and break down those fat stores to turn over the dead cells to do all the cleaning repairs and maintenance, if you will. Because when we eat a standard high carb diet, a lot of times we're, we're grazing. So if you want to lose fat fast, I think what you need to do is help your body go through the detoxification. Right. Along with that, getting enough hydration. Yeah. So, so my, that you can my, flush out the toxins. My number two would be adequate sleep. Yes. And paired with that, not eating three hours before bedtime, right? So good sleep hygiene would be number two. Yeah. So that would be avoiding bright lights in the evening. So our phones, our computers, all of our technology these days have a night setting where the screen kind of goes that orangey color. Yeah. So you want to turn those on on your devices. So um, the, these if, are actually blue blocking lenses. Like. So a lot, yeah. So a lot of the, if you wear glasses, a lot of the lenses today are blue blocking. Um, so that's what you're looking for is to block the blue light. So you can also buy very inexpensive glasses on Amazon. Like if you're a TV watcher at night, most TVs don't have that setting to block the oh, blue yeah. light yet. I'm not sure why. Maybe I'm sure they will in the future. But you can get very inexpensive, dorky, real dorky looking glasses to wear as you lay in bed and watch TV at night. So try to go to bed at the same time every night. Um just getting into a rhythm of yeah, having good sleep. quality sleep, good sleep patterns. Uh, and then number three would be really dialing in the macros. If you're if you're looking for serious weight loss, then you have to be a little bit. If that's your goal, then you've got to be on point with your macros. And that means logging your food, and knowing we, what you're eating. Yeah, knowing what you're eating and knowing what your macros are. It's not a forever thing, but when you're wanting to lose weight fast, it's important because we're, we're so trained to eat in a different style when we start keto that it's not intuitive. And so it's not natural to eat the way you need to eat to get into ketosis. So we really like chronometer. Easy to use. It calculates everything for you. So is that our number three? Tracking? Yeah. Yeah. And then number four would be exercise. So if you're starting from zero, exercise would be brisk walks every day, some yoga, maybe look at Pilates or some other Tai Chi, something to help calm and ground your body. Yeah, a lot of people will go from a completely sedentary lifestyle where they're not doing any exercise and get this great idea like, I'm going to go to a CrossFit gym. Now, there are CrossFit gyms out there and gyms out there where the people that are running those gyms are extremely skilled in dealing with varying levels of fitness. But some places you go and they're like, expect you to do exactly what everybody else is doing. And that's a great way to get hurt. So, like Tara said, if you're going to start a fitness regimen, you need to build up, right? Yeah, so don't go start. someplace and expect that you're going to be doing overhead squats on day one because you're just going to end up hurting yourself. So hopefully those tips help. Um, there's a lot of ways to accelerate fast loss on the keto diet, but those are some good getting started tips.